Uh, hey, this conversation that we've been having, it's absolutely wonderful, and I don't mean to be rude, but I just realized I needed to ask Armin something yesterday, and I may or may not have forgotten completely about it. Do you mind if I run off now before I forget again? Oh, thanks. You're awesome. I'll be right back, I promise. Ugh. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Why? Why now? It's not even a full moon. Why? Why? <sighs> okay, okay. Just calm down. <sighs> okay. Stress just makes it worse, makes it more difficult to control. I have complete control right now. That's all that matters. As long as I'm in control, I'll be fine. She'll be fine. Okay. Now, I just need to get to the forest. And hopefully, once I turn, I'll, I'll be fine again. I hope that's the case this time. It always is, but this feels different. I can't put my finger on it precisely, but something strange is definitely going on. And given the circumstances, that's cause for alarm. Okay, okay. Just breathe in and out, in and out. Everything's going to be okay. No one else is out here. No one would follow. She's the only one. She is the only person who could have possibly seen me go this way. Of course. That makes it difficult. I was so close to her. Her scent. It's lingering. Unless she's being completely silent. Which I doubt she is. I'm sure she's not here. Any sound she would have made, I'm sure I would have heard. Humans. They can never be completely quiet. I'm certain she didn't follow me. Why would she? I went to see Armin. He's my best friend. Why would she need to follow me? Unless, of course, she's noticed my behavior. No, no. That's impossible. I've gotten good at hiding it. Haven't I? Uh, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. I have to. Before I lose control and hurt her or someone else, I have to. <clears throat> what the? Why isn't it working? Why... Why am I still... Like this? I have to try again. Come on, come on, please work. Ah! Damn it. Wait. Ah! What the hell? Why am I only partially transformed? What the hell is going on? <clears throat> if I turn around and I don't see a squirrel, a rabbit, or some other 
woodland creature. I'm going to freak out. Uh. Oh god. Oh. It's... It's you. Wait, no, no! Uh. Please, please, don't, don't run. Please. I, I can explain all of this. Please, just don't run. Don't scream. Don't, don't panic, please. Look, look at me. I'm not going to hurt you, okay? I haven't hurt you before. Why would I hurt you now? See? See? It's okay. Just please calm down. You don't have to run from me. It's me. It's Aaron. One of your best friends. You don't have to be scared of me just because of this. Okay, if I let you go, are you going to run? All right. I'm trusting you. I trust you. I hope you can trust me. See? Everything's fine. Now, I trust that you're wondering what the hell is going on. To be honest, I am too. But I'll explain to the best of my ability, alright? I guess the best thing to start off with would be stating what I am. I am, in addition to being a titan shifter, a werewolf. I know that sounds crazy, it sounds like the most ridiculous thing in the world, but you can see with your own two eyes that right now I do have wolf-like features under normal circumstances. I'd be a wolf, an actual wolf right now, but something's going on with me and I don't know what it is. I'm always fidgety and I feel nervous all the time and I feel so hot randomly and normally this only happens when it's close to a full moon but the full moon has passed I have no idea what's going on with me that's why I came out here usually when I get like this turning into a wolf, giving in to that side of myself. It helps. No, no. I don't hurt anyone while I'm in my wolf form. In fact, the only reason I even take my wolf form at all is to avoid hurting people. See, if I don't give in to that side of myself at least once in a while, before a full moon, then on the night of a full moon, I have absolutely no control over myself. It's like back in Trost, when I attacked Mikasa. I had no control. Only, I'm more dangerous when I'm in my wolf form. You know why? My fur is the same color as my hair. I look like a large dog, and I can blend in fairly easily with the forest. 
no one would see me coming. And if they did, they wouldn't run. They might approach me. And I would. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm scaring you, aren't I? I'm so sorry. But the point is, that's why I turn into a wolf at random. I do it to prevent that from happening. Only this time. I can't take my full wolf form. As you can see, I've only partially changed. I have the ears. Regrettably, the tail, which is stuck in my uniform. That's getting really uncomfortable. And the fangs of a wolf, which actually would come in quite handy. Just for harming myself when I need to become a titan. Huh? Oh. I guess I have the eyes as well. Uh. How long have I been like this? Since I was a kid. Back when I lived in Shiganshina. I remember I was helping Armin get back home. He was badly hurt, so I offered to help him since it was dark. I didn't want him to trip and fall and potentially injure himself worse than he was already. And then when I was returning to my own home, I saw a large, dog-like creature. Of course, being the idiot I am, I thought it would be a good idea to throw a rock at it. Definitely an error on my part. It attacked me, and it managed to bite me, right on my leg. I screamed, and one of the neighbors came outside, managed to shoo it away. And then, after that, it's a blur of extremely painful memories. Memories of being afraid, being completely helpless, because I knew I couldn't tell anyone about this. And, and neither can you, okay? Please promise you won't say anything about this to anyone. No. Absolutely no one else knows. Not even Mikasa or Armin. You and I are now the only ones who know about this. You can't tell anyone. I know. I know that they accepted me for who I was when, when it became known that apparently I can turn into a titan. But this is different. This is something that no one will understand. And if I just go and tell them, they'll think I'm crazy. If I try to show them, well, look at me now. I can't take 
my full wolf form? What if I try to and nothing happens? They're going to think I'm insane, delusional, psychotic. And they'll think it's not safe to have me around. If I'm insane and I can turn into a titan, they'll have me executed. I can't risk that. So please, I'm begging you, don't tell anyone. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you so much. You have no idea what this means to me, really. Uh, well, I don't know. I don't know how I can return to normal. When I take my full wolf form, usually I'll run out of energy. I'll fall asleep somewhere, and when I wake up, I'm a human again. But with this, I don't know. Really, I have no idea what could be causing this. Well, that's a lie, actually. I think I've been lying to myself about it all along. In all honesty, I was ashamed to admit the truth. I was ashamed, embarrassed, and honestly, there was no way for me to tell if I was right. So I didn't want to say that I might be right. The truth is, I can't believe I'm saying this. I read one of Armin's books once, and it said that werewolves can't take their full wolf form when they come of age, and this is so stupid. I just forget I said anything, okay? This time of the year is mating season for werewolves, okay? And we can't take our wolf forms except on full moons, of course. Because it would be dangerous. We might end up hurting humans and we might end up getting attacked by true wolves because it's their mating season as well. And I think I think that's why You... You've heard that too? Seriously? Huh. I didn't realize you knew anything about werewolves. Interesting. Um... Before you leave... You'll want to. Trust me. Someone might get worried about you. I... I just want to tell you that when I've been getting fidgety and 
nervous and unexplainably hot. It was... It was when I was around you. Look, I'm pretty sure it's no secret that I've had a crush on you for a while. And I guess since I'm apparently a part of this whole mating season nonsense now, I guess that was my body's way of telling me to telling me to confess my feelings for you. Look, I I know that this is a lot of information all at once, so I completely understand if you don't have a response to that at all, if you don't know how you feel, I completely understand. Just, please, if you don't feel the same way, or if you kind of resent me for feeling that way about you, please, don't let that drive you to tell anyone about this. I'm trusting you. I would... I would follow you into battle. Completely defenseless. That's how much I trust you. Please. Don't make me regret my decision. <laughs>